What's up, Sudbury? This is Coach Stutz from Sirius still. Uh, I told you we'll talk about basketball a lot more in this video blog, so we'll get ready to dive right into video blog number three, talk about what Sirius is doing with basketball. Before we do that, I just want to give everybody a heads up. You know, um, I am taking coronavirus tests, uh, wearing mask, sanitizing. Uh, obviously, encourage everybody to keep doing that uh, just to control coronavirus. Um, stay safe. Uh, we're trying to do our best to be safe out here as well. Um, so let's talk about basketball a little bit. So Syria is really revamping basketball on all fronts. They're rebuilding it from youth leagues, youth coaches, referees, up to professional level, coaches, refs, players, development, development on all levels. So this week has kind of been you know, a one-stop shop for Syria in Damascus for basketball, referee clinics, coaches clinics, youth nationals, um, national team training camp to get ready for our qualifiers. So it's been really cool just to be a part of everything going on. Um, got to speak at a coach's clinic, do a PowerPoint presentation over kind of the Sudbury Fives offense and on our fast break and our style of play, which raised a lot of questions, but people were very open to it, which was exciting that I got to share that um, with this part of the world. Um, and then the refs, refing clinic was, was good, too, to see the refs. You know, they're going over the FIBA rules. They came to our practices. They watched. They refed our practices to help us out. Um, I showed you some of the, the cl uh, clips from the youth nationals that were going on with U16, U18, um, which was great. And then, you know, a lot of people want to know about the national team here in Syria. So to let everybody know, similar to, like, a Canada's national team on that level, um, USA national team, every country. We invited 22 people to training camp. We have to cut it down, cut it down, cut it down to about uh, 12 active roster, and then we can bring a couple in reserve. So it's been very competitive. Um, got some clips, got some some pictures that, that I'll show you. It's been a lot of fun working with these guys. Um, it all, it's always tough to, to cut, to make your cuts because, you know, you invest in people. And uh, say the one cool thing is Siri here, these guys want to win so bad. Even the ones that, that get let go, are very thankful for the opportunity. Um, they wish the best for the team, and they're still just as much a part of the team because they helped us develop, and we're reaching towards that goal of qualification. So it's cool, cool to see that they're still with it, um, knowing there could be an opportunity for them next time. Um, but as for the basketball front, I'm, I'm really excited because, like I said, I got to introduce some of the stuff we do in Sudbury to the youth coaches, and you know, actually, we're going to be doing some of it on the national team, which is really exciting. Um, with our fast break and our transition. And then Coach Joe is kind of putting in his half-court set and his uh, defensive tactics, which are very good. Uh, I'm learning a lot on that front as well. Coach Joe is a, a great coach, teaching me a lot about defense, um, some things that everybody back in Sudbury knows I need to work on. So I'm, I'm growing not only um, with the team, but um, on a coaching level too, which is, which is really good for my development and everything. So, you know, Kind of wrap it up there. We'll put some videos of the guys playing, some pictures up. Um, end it with a fun video because the guys are getting getting along great and, and, and having a blast. But for the most part, we got a couple more days here in Damascus. Then we're going to take off to uh, probably Doha and uh, start kind of a, a training camp away from everything to get these guys focused and get on the same level so we can go qualify. Um, I, I'm excited, though, because this is the same same level that, that Team Canada has their, their, their qualifiers for uh, – believe down in Puerto Rico. Um, it's the same level. It's kind of the same tournament that, that we're trying to qualify, ultimately the World Cup. So we'll see if we can make it happen. But uh, right now, I'm getting ready to head off to practice. So I wish you guys a great day. And uh, I'll be back. Video blog number four will be really cool. It'll be about how, how all these festivals kind of end, how basketball, um, the clinics, the referees, the training camp kind of ends. We had a fun little celebration. So I'm looking forward to share that with you guys. All right. Take care.